What's up, everybody? Ready to ship 23 sneaker.edu and mag for some of you that for some of you that know me. Damn, homie, that's some tight ass kicks right there. What's up with them? Well, they for sale, or they are for sale if you like correct English. Um, they look good, don't they? They're a little worn. We're going to go over some of the things that the shoe needs. Some of the things the shoe doesn't need. The shoes need a good owner, not a dickhead. Alright, this is the um, the left shoe. This is the shoe that has the most, uh, I, I would say, issues with. They're used, you know, they're not a, a, a 10 out of 10 or anything like that, but there's still a lot of life left. If you can see here through the uh, through the um, was it patent leather? There's some uh, stuff just it's just coming off. You know what I'm saying? So, but here we're going into the real. Oh snap! <laughs> Alright, here we're going to the real area here. Um, where there's uh, issues here. This area, man, I think is like burnt or melted or whatever. Because I've tried just about everything that can't harm the shoe to remove it. And it's just not happening. And I wouldn't want to try anything else that might just remove paint or whatever. Now, the Nike check here, uh, originally is has like in the white area is like all messed up so obviously you can see whoever did this they can't paint and that was me i can't paint that was done with a nail polish so it's kind of like a little plaster there but as you saw now when you're rocking it ain't nobody telling you nothing because you can't see it if you can paint or you have a homeboy that 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 can paint or or you want to do that as a project then you know it's something that I just want to make you wear. I don't want to be like, oh, these are perfect shoes, and then you get them, they're all messed up. So they do come with the green laces. Hey, Merry Christmas. Uh, so here in the back, you have this, and then uh, you know the midsole is good. The airbag unit is most messed up a little bit here. It's just you know wear, scratched up and whatnot. Uh, these are to rock man these are to wear if you're gonna put them in your rotation don't lie to yourself and say you're gonna wear them every day and all this crap you're probably gonna wear them once once a month um and when you do wear them nobody's gonna be like hey let me take off your shoe let me take a look at it i mean they're not in the shape where uh somebody from far away can see that they're messed up if that's one of your worries if you like dead stock shoes get ready to pay Anywhere from 260 to 300 dollars for a brand new pair, or, or maybe even more. Uh, okay, so that's the uh, the left shoe, the left sneaker, and let's get right quick to the right one because the right one is just about perfect. As you can see here in the patent leather, there is no scrapes, rips, or, any, or tears. The previous owner, I guess he <laughs> he liked messing up with his left shoe. Uh, well, here we go. A little patent leather uh, scrape right there. Uh, the shoelace here doesn't have the, uh, at the end, it doesn't have the thing where it says LeBron James like this one. Uh, like it's broken. So there's just a little bit of tape uh, rolled around this to make it easy for me to lace that that laces up. Uh, same thing with here. Um, this one's uh, scratched up in the Air Max unit a little bit. Thank God they're black. Where it's not like, oh my gosh, it looks horrible. Um, I gave these a nice, uh, decent little clean, so they're a little bit white in the bottom, the, a uh, little bit worn, I say they still got a pretty good life to them, worst thing that can happen is that you can resell these shoes if you really don't like them, but it's tough, I'm selling these, um, I don't even know why to be honest with you, I actually like them a lot, but uh, there's a, there's something right now that I would rather have more than these, and, and uh, I'm also going to be selling my Floridians, so 
look out for that, okay? All right, thank you.